I demonstrated poor judgment and I take full responsibility for my actions. That's what new Mavericks guard Raymond Felton said after being suspended for the first four games of next season for pleading guilty to gun charges. I'm Kerry Chow, joined by ESPN Dallas's Tim McMahon. Tim, what's the full punishment here for Felton? Well, it's the four games from the NBA, and then you know, his plea deal with the state of New York. He got a $5,000 fine and 500 hours of community service. That community service doesn't have to be served in the state of New York, and Mark Cuban said in a statement today that the Mavericks are in the process of setting up a foundation with Felton that uh, will help people in North Texas. It's four games out of an 82-game season. How will this suspension affect the team? Uh, they, obviously, they knew there was going to be something coming from the NBA when they traded for Felton. Frankly, he was a throw-in along with a Tyson Chandler deal. And it, it just is four games that uh, they'll have to wait for him, but they have two other point guards that they like, and Devin Harris and Jameer Nelson, who they uh, signed this summer. And the, the plan all along was to have those three split time. So for the first two games, instead of three guys splitting time, it'll just be uh, it'll just be Devin Harris and Jameer Nelson. What are the expectations for Felton this season? Between the three of them, is one guy expected to become the main guy? Not necessarily. Uh, th their plan is to play all three, and that way they can you know, really get up and down the floor, have those point guards constantly pushing the ball and not worry about having to pace themselves. Now, the Mavericks are optimistic that the Felton they'll get will be not the same guy that the Knicks had last year. Felton admits that he stunk last year. There, there's no question that's the case. What the Mavs are hoping and thinking is they're going to get a Raymond Felton that's motivated, that's in good shape, and that can really thrive on this roster in the role that they have uh, in mind for him, which, again, is about a 20-minute-per-game role. It's ESPN Dallas's Tim McMahon. Tim, thanks as always. Thanks for having me. For the latest on the Mavericks, be sure to check out ESPNDallas.com. For Tim McMahon, I'm Kerry Chow with your latest ESPN headline.